Hi, I'm Jesse Seldes, reading from Kensington neighborhood of Brooklyn, New York, and this is Poets House Presents. So I'm going to read uh, from this book, Several Rotations, which was published um, toward the end of last year by Kenning Editions, a wonderful press based in Chicago, Illinois. Um, and I'll start by reading uh, the first section in its entirety called In, um, and then I'll read just a few pages from a few of the other um, sections of the book, all of which were influenced by a computer program I wrote um, that used the remnants of the process of writing that first section in. And as an introduction to this, to these poems, I want to read um, some questions that I wrote. How do we locate and orient ourselves amidst the continuous present of inconspicuously networked devices and services? With tracked interests reinforced to impulses through millisecond auctions for ad impressions and sponsored content, what are our desires and dreams? With products valued as a function of the strength of the habits they create, where are our values and actions? One, I assume the offer's reliable and maybe regrettable in that I cannot remember I assume the offer is revisitable, revisable. I assume the offer is divisible. I assumed that they were visible and came home to rewind inflections and could be inflected with reasons and came home to rewind, stopping in the middle decisions that can be attributable before I act on them, which is not necessarily possible. Preamble. We ask, say in that case, speech that is of, by, prospects, by, in the sound privacy, which, as tracked, befitted, phrase them of our possessions. Passwords. I have them lost. I have them trust in me that having been after content, after having been contented, I swayed a little in my state, reflexing, indented in my phone, an irretrievable advantage in the long time they were on. I learned my point. I learned the point of standing. I learned the point where I am. I learned my approval rendered approximately. I learned my approximate point requesting my standing for my own purposes. Five. I have entered my phone. Who knows the way? Stopped light with validated, variegated fields. Battery, dawn, nights blending themselves. By my memory elsewhere, I answered about, which I feel formally about for, not literally moved about. Six. Red bud and cherry and one wild apple tree. Seven. Elsewhere my memory, I have entered my purchases. I have entered my purposes and other types of tracking technology and elsewhere my memory, where I host my purposes, where I stand and retrieve, relive, where I stand aside and retrieve, aside the impulse to my purpose, where I stand and retrieve, the impulse to my purpose, where I stand aside, the impulse for my own purchases, the impulse for my own purposes, where I send and retrieve aside, where I end, the impulse for my own prospects, where I stand and relive, I send and retrieve aside the impulse, where I send and relive aside, I stand and retrieve the impulse, I send and retrieve the impulse. Full of the missing words. And the canyon spun around the dogs and lilies, red bud and cherry, and one wild apple tree.
dream pigeon. I came back to me. I captured an after image. I watch a movie, red bud and cherry and one wild apple tree. I watch a moving after image without ensuing damage. I came after my past. I came back to me. Under the last seen principle, I resume visions attributable, then blue and sun again a second, then night. Post song. And the canyon spun around the dogs and lilies. And from a weak distance, where I need gravity, I tell you my purposes. Post. While they're up in the sky, I tell you the weight of my purchases until I purpose up in the sky. While we're up in the sky, my purchase up in the sky, until my purpose up in the sky, until I purchase up in the sky, my purpose up in the sky. 12. If I take a different measure in traversing my purchase, if I take some different measure, what I do in my leisure, I reuse unassimilable visions, talking into pheasants bending themselves. The long time I had a vision without the long time I was accounting. Where I take my leisure, I take it out in the snowfall tomorrow. 13. I had me a vision, there was no promotion tomorrow. And as an extension of the values, I was enjoined to act against myself. I hear it between bills and stuffed animals. The snow. Right now, I'm the cart. Falling from this distance, falling from my face, and not falling at all. Face falling off the edge of the face, value falling off the edge of the face. 15. Then I constellate my time, family, country, reasons, resources, in a sharp upward turn, where I sleep at times. Asynchronous, slow. 16. I brought my head down, I brought my qualities down in a continuous vertiginous dream. I brought my head down, I brought my qualities down in a continuous theme. I put my bread down, I brought my count down, I put my head down. Off the edge of the world. I am first in the office to be before the sun. 18. And as an extension of the values, with little reason, embodied with little visions, full of aspirations, embodied with little aspirations, little visions full of potential, with little reason, I aspirate with little visions, with little reason to aspirations, embodied with little reason, and as an extension of the values, embodied aspirations, full of aspirations, little visions, full of potential. The sun isn't up. I speak to them, my possessions, and move them literally with me, back up through the results, out of remnant pages. I was advised to rewind higher up, where I can claim to see the moons, to see the patterns on the birds, to see the sunrise.
If I step on the edge and reach up the screen to see the sunrise, dawn formerly nights in the face that I have, what I do in my leisure with my ways to the end, off the end, I take it out in the snowfall of my actions, standing in memory, aligned or not with my interests, but to me directly. So I back up until my purpose up in the sky, when I move high up in the internet, erodes the impulse for my own purposes, variegated, reflected, retroactive, reactive light from which to step off. In the inflected, refracted, retroactive, reactive light out in the snow, I turn not sad exactly, out of remnant ages, live connections, before the sun isn't available, visible or regrettable or reliable or revisitable or revisable or divisible or attributable or assimilable. When I woke up in the morning over the long time up in the sky, I could consume the dream in the space that it had. In my world, variegated, reflected, retroactive, reactive light, stopped light with validated, variegated fields. In the inflected, refracted, retroactive, reactive light, I speak as a pure product that can hear. Thank you so much for listening. Thank you to Kenning Editions for publishing this book and to Poet's House. Poet's House is a variegated, reflected, inflected, refracted, active light, which I am anxious to be able to visit again, and I wish uh, the same for you all. If you've enjoyed these programs, please consider giving a contribution to Poets House. For more than 30 years, they've kept the door wide open to everyone for the joy of poetry. Recently, they have temporarily had to shut the door and are reeling from the financial implications. Please give, even a small donation, if you can. Thank you.